Welcome back to another segment of Behind the Scenes of the Waltons. Today I have something special for you. Uh, Linda Pearl, who is a guest on our show in two episodes, both early on in the episode The Spoilers, and then later in season five, she returned as the character Vanessa, uh, Kurt, my husband Kurt's younger sister, uh, who comes into town and breaks Jason's heart. The two of them, John Wamsley and Linda Pearl, met up recently while Linda was on tour with a show in England. And they had uh, a little reunion. He saw her show and the two sat down at a local pub and were kind enough to shoot video for all of us uh, as they reminisced. So let's enjoy the little visit between John and Linda. Hello, Hi Judy. there. Hi, Judy. Hi, Walton's fans. Hi, Walton's fans. So we are, I'm Linda Pearl. This is the extraordinary John Walmsley. Hello. We are in Bath. Uh, John is in the pub. In the pub, of course. Appropriately. Cheers. Cheers. Um, John and his gorgeous wife, Miriam, live in England. And since we've known each other, which was, all right, 46, 19. 48 years ago. We've remained fast friends yes. through acting, but also through music. Yes. John is an extraordinary guitarist and musician. We've performed together a few times. Yes. A number of times. And we, after the Waltons, we would we would hang out sometimes. And we would write <laughs> songs. John would write wonderful songs. I would write terrible songs. And no, John no. would always say, "They were so good. Keep going. Keep yes, going." Yes. Oh my God. I have some tape. I found some of them recently. Oh my God. I think that's part of the joy of a show like the Waltons, that these friendships, we're here to testify, friendships that, that started there are it's long true. lasting. Yeah. It's true. I think, uh, I, I, for me, definitely, um, the friendships are the greatest gift that I took away from that experience. And, and meeting you is wonderful. <laughs> oh, well. And I, I have to say, if, if you are lucky enough, have friends like this lady. You are very blessed. Thank you. You, you've been there for me in some really tough times. Well, we've done happens. You know, Happy times and, and difficult times. Transitional, yeah. Oh, well, here's the thing. When my son was turning eight, I think. John and my son have, the same, have the same birthday. Just a couple years apart. And uh, <laughs> Lucius was a soccer guy, and he was going to have a soccer pet, but and he broke his collarbone, so we couldn't have the soccer party. And I said, well, honey, what do you want to do for your birthday? He said, I'd like to have the Rolling Stones play in the backyard. He's like, well, can't do that. And he said, yes, you can, Mommy. You can move the dog poo. It's fine. They can perform. He didn't know. So second best, only to the Rolling Stones, I called John. I said, John, can you come play some rock and roll? And he said, you bet. On the day, he had a fever, on his birthday, he had a fever of 102, and he came anyway, and he played rock and roll in our backyard. As far as Lucius was concerned, this was the Rolling Stones in our backyard. I am a good friend. Yeah, you are. Yeah. So the Waltons. So Judy has this great video show, and you did, I think you may be the only person who did two episodes playing two different characters. So the first one was, was uh, The Spoilers. Yes, right? it's kind of a brat. Which I, I had to say, I don't really remember that episode. I, I just remember a terrifying I moment <laughs> where I was serving tea and I was new to the business on film. I didn't know that you had the match. So I was busy in the first shot pouring tea and, you know, sugar and milk. I didn't know that she then had to repeat the exact same thing. And the script supervisor was thinking, oh no. So we had to do take after take after take so that Dum Dum here could actually match that. But he was very patient and really made me feel badly. So we got through that. Well, that's, that's how you learn. That's right. You learn. And, and now, when we act, we know to do the same thing every that's time. Right. And make it simple. And the, and the, edit, and the editors love us. Yeah, that's right. And then the second one, we got to sing together. Right. That was the heartbreaker. You were the heartbreaker. Oh, oh sorry. Right. So, so Linda, in the second episode, played the sister of Kurt Willard, who was the doctor, 
that Mary Ellen married. So he was he was my brother-in-law, and then you came in as the sister, and I fell for you, um, as you can well imagine. Um, just head over heels and wrote a song for you, Vanessa's song. That I remember, which I, which I did write actually. And we sang Our Fly Away, and we sang, uh, and you sang Vanessa's song, beautifully. And then you dumped me. <laughs> Foolish girl, clearly. Yes. And you never did another Waltons after that. That's right, they didn't that was, have me back. That was the punishment for oh, Vanessa so dumping Jason. Good but, times. It's, but, it, but it was just that. And that lot, oh my gosh, to get to the Walton set, you're watching the Kung Fu set and all of these other great, I mean, it was a happening place. Yeah. Do you, do you really remember our scene? In that show, one thing I remember, and I've, I've told the story, I'll see if you remember. Um, do you remember our, our scene on the lake? Lake, yeah. In the boat? In the boat. Where I was serenading you on guitar? Yeah. It was part of like a montage thing. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So we had, and Ralph Waite was directed, oh, oh right? Gosh, yeah. So we, we were on, we were getting ready to, to do this scene. Uh, maybe I should let you tell the story. No, I no, I, no, no, you tell it. Okay, because we were getting ready to go in this rowboat, right? It was a little dock on the, on the back lot. Drusilla's pond. Not only knows what was in that water, it was right. lethal. Yes, yes, exactly. So we were getting in the boat and I got in with my little guitar, right? So the dock. You got in the boat, right? And as you got one foot in the boat, you got one foot in the dock, and then your feet started to do this, right? It's not going to work out well. Splits. So you took a big step into the boat. Now, I had moved over thinking when you get in the boat, I'll balance it out. Right. Suddenly we were both on the one side and we capsized. And Ralph Wade, thought I did it on purpose, which actually I, I might have done. <laughs> I had it not been for the fact that I had a 1958 Martin guitar in my hand and an antique gold pocket watch in my pocket, and we both had radio mics. So uh, fortunately, uh, we, they called lunch, Ralph was very angry. And uh, so we went to lunch, we got out of the wet clothes because we were drenched. I stood up, because the lake was only three feet deep. I stood up, turned the guitar over, and water gushed out. We, we went to lunch, and thankfully, the prop master stuffed my guitar with paper towels during the lunch. Came back from lunch, the guitar was fine. Actually, I think the pocket watch was okay. Radio mics. Not so much. Not they can so be much. replaced. I, I was I was just afraid that I was going to get stuck with the bill for this thing. Oh, God yeah. knows how many hundreds I'm of dollars. I'm sure it's happened before. Order. I'm sure better actors than us have been dumped in that lake before. But anyway, we did our bit. Yeah. That was fun. Anyway, it's good, so good cool goodness. that you're doing this, Judy. And thank you for asking me. And it's just great to See you and, and you were wonderful in the show tonight. Oh, thanks. Yeah, we're Catch over here doing a play ball. for six months. It's, it's fun. With the, with the lovely and talented Patrick Duncan. Yes, yeah. It's a, it's a gift from the universe. Yeah. We're tooling around. We've been here four months. We have two months to go. Tonight was our 102nd performance. Only 46 to go. But anyway, it's good fun. So, great to see you all. And uh, hope to see you again. Take care. I really want to thank John and Linda for shooting this video for me, and I hope you enjoyed uh, seeing their little reunion. I will be back with more behind the scenes of the Waltons and more Ask Judy and also more of that interview I had with Mary McDonough. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching.